violinist Jamie Laredo, cellist Sharon Robinson, and the distinguished violist from the Guarneri String Quartet, Michael Tree. Sasha, for years you have taught, inspired, and influenced literally hundreds and hundreds of musicians. So tonight, a few of us are here to thank you and to wish you at least another 80 years of creativity. Sasha, you have shared your artistry, your vision, and your incredible energy with musicians and audiences throughout the world. So tonight, we want to give you a musical bouquet. Sasha, believe it or not, there are four generations of musicians on the stage who love you. And joining Isaac and Sharon and Jamie and me are nine young players whom you have taught and inspired. I'm Herbert Greenberg, concertmaster of the Baltimore Symphony Orchestra. I am Hirona Oka of the Concerto Soloists of Philadelphia. I'm Martin Chalifour, Associate Concertmaster of the Atlanta Symphony. I'm Pamela Frank, student at the Curtis Institute of Music in Philadelphia. I'm Ira Weller, violist in the Metropolitan Opera Orchestra and founding member of the Mendelssohn String Quartet. I'm Kathleen Mattis, Associate Principal Violist of the St. Louis Symphony Orchestra. I'm Carolyn Davis, double bassist with Philharmonia Virtuosi of New York. I'm Peter Wiley, cellist with the Beaux-Arts Trio. I am Troy Stewart, a cellist at the Oberlin Conservatory of Music. And my dream has always been to become a concert cellist. And from the bottom of my heart, Sasha, I would like to thank you. Thank you for teaching me that with hope, discipline, and with the love of one's art, and the city of Baltimore is not that far from Carnegie Hall. <laughs> With grateful heart, Sasha, we would like to play for you one of your most beloved and loved musical moments, the last movement of the Brandenburg Concerto Number no. 3.